Hey guys, greetings. How you doing? I hope you are doing well. Welcome to Vinal TV. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider subscribing. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. I want to show you what we got here. This gear is HP MV 6000 series. 6020 to be precise. This gear is everything family need. It's made for many and loved by all. It's multifunctional, multi-tax, triple in one if you like. In the sense that you can copy, scan and print from this printer. It's wireless or you can also say that this printer is dual band. Basically, you can connect it via wireless network, cableless, and also you can connect it via USB cable. But I just want to mention that this printer doesn't have USB cable right with it. So if you purchase this printer, you need to get the USB cable separately. I'm going to show you what the USB cable lo looks like. This is the USB cable for this printer. If you have not got internet service on your home, so you need to use this to be able to connect this printer to your laptop or your PC. Okay, but these days, if you have Wi-Fi network at your home, they expect you to connect this via wireless. If you check my video, you will see how we connected this printer to Wi-Fi network. We loaded the paper tray. We loaded also the ink cartridges. We also complete and print the alignment head. To do that, you need to print alignment head on all your printers so that it will function properly okay i just want to show you some of the features from on this printer then we we'll go from there and what i want us to do is to scan a document but before i want to show you some of the features from this printer i will start from the back like i said earlier so this is the power cable for this printer and from power cable on top of the power cable you see this is the on and off button for this printer the usb cable goes right here okay this is where the usb cable go so you stick the cable in this usb cable is universal so basically epson can use it canon can use it other printers can use it okay so i'm going to take this off now this is the scanner for this printer beautiful stuff okay so you stick your document on top of the scanner then you select the function right here and it will do the job okay so i also want to open up the printer right here once you open it up the ink cartridges will come right in front of you to the middle for you to change it if you check my video you see how we loaded the ink cartridges this printer is using 305 hp ink cartridges you might also get 305 compatible one but this is original hp okay black and three colors that three color consists of red blue and yellow you can get instant in three months deliver on your home door with this printer once you already start the essence of it you save up to 70 percent on ink and you never out of, of ink but that service is not free of charge. I'm afraid you need to register with HP service to be able to receive that service. You can cancel it at any time. Okay. So right now, I also want to mention if you have any paper jam, where to check is open up right here. Bring out the cover and look. Okay. To see if there's any paper or debris here. And if there is, you take it off. Okay. And make sure you cover put back the cover and you push it down you hear a click sound if you want to take it off you press this two spring okay so press it together you will see arrow here so press it together and open it up and the center now the same time make sure you close it okay once you check this area if you if you did not find any issue or any debris or paper jam right here if you close it down go at the back here also check at the back here you can also check for any paper jam right here you make sure you check for any paper jam if there is you take it off okay so you look over here as well and once you've done that make sure you close this print close this down okay so right now this is 
how to check for any paper jam and the function okay i want to show you also right in middle of this printer you see this light here is for wi-fi network blue light is for wi-fi this button here is information light this button here is to cancel this button here is to press color and the other one is also to press black this button here is to resume okay if there's any issue what i want us to do like i said is to scan a document okay and for us to scan a document i want us to go to the app okay you go to back to hp smart app okay you see how we connected this printer to wi-fi network okay so what i want us to do is you go, we go back to smart app okay once you click smart app this printer you will see it it will tell you right here ready to print okay so it's showing us here this is the printer hp mv6000 series so on this app right now you can see instant ink printable smart tax okay mobile fast camera scan help and support okay and also print photo print document printer scan and copy okay what i want us to do is to scan a document so to scan a document so you stick the document i have a book here i love anything you want by their silver 40 lesson for a new kind of entrepreneurs so i just stick the book right here okay and close the scanner is the same thing with your document id or what have you so click on printer scanner if you click on printer scanner it will take you right here so you select the document or the book you have here i mean the paper you have we have here is a4 paper okay so i'm gonna close it so you select a4 paper if you have different paper or letter five by seven four by six 3.5 you select make sure you select the particular paper you have right here what we have here is a4 paper so i'm gonna select a4 paper the next thing you can do is you can pre-scan for you to get preview of what you are going to scan so click this button here it will start fetching preview okay so this is the document will scan or the book will scan this is the preview of it if there's anything you want to change then you change it but looking at things i'm happy with this so what i'm gonna do is click go ahead and click scan right now it's scanning okay so this is the first one okay the next thing to do if you want to scan another document okay you take this out and stick it on top of the scanner and click plus in the middle of the scanner the next thing to do is either you select preview or click scan again nice right now what we have it will scan two documents or two books if you like okay so this is the first one and this is the second one okay the other thing to do is for us to print this out this document will scan to print it out you just need to press print okay if you press print now you select how many copies you want okay so the document is here you can also select black or white okay so what i want us to do is to print it okay make sure you select the particular printer so you select print it connected Tettering. Hi. 
power on Harry. Connected. So this is the first one. Okay, so this is the first and second. This is the book we scan. Okay, I'm printed it out. Okay, now I want us to show you also if you want to send this to somebody. Okay, what you need to do is click share on your mobile device. Once you click share, right, make sure you select PDF document. JPG is usually for photos, so make sure you select PDF. Okay, and the next thing you need to do is click share. So if you click share, it will ask you share using. So you share it to different platform. So you can send it to email. You can also send it to WhatsApp or Yahoo Mail, Canon Print. So this is the just a different platform you can send it. Okay. So I'm gonna click share. Click share to email. Now the next thing you need to do is just type in the email address of the person you want to send this to okay so i'm gonna put send my email address the subject usually anything maybe just book or, or letter or whatever what you want just put the subject just to remind the person what you want what you are sending the next thing you need to do is also click send now it will start to send you can also i just want to mention that you can adjust the size i sent off right now actual size you can actually change the size to medium or to small or if you like so once you finish sending it the next thing you need to do is come off from this app and go to your email address and look for this document to see whether it's inside in your inside your email so what i'm going to do right now go back to my email address here we go this document is here is there already on my email so click download once you click download you open up this document click open for you to see it here we go this is the first one and this is the second one you can also print it out as well okay so to print it out you can select print you select print from your email okay then make sure you look for you make sure you look for the printer that you have here to for you to be able to print select print okay and you look for the print you have okay so we what we need to do is look for hp mv6000 series okay and it's there the next thing to do is also make sure you have hp mv6000 series okay select print here we go right now if you want to cancel this job you press cancel it will, it will cancel the job so right now it's cancel okay i press this cancel button and cancel this job thank you very much guys this is how to scan your document print and share with others if you're happy with this tutorial please smash the like button share this with your friends and family this is how to scan your document share and print Thank you very much and stay blessed.